All right, we're gonna get going on part two. So if, I think we need to do this strategically by um, got this rag already bleached out. <laughs> I'm gonna do this strategically by doing the uh, white first. Yeah, the bleach white first. And what we wanna make sure is that it's a little damp because it says that that's how the bleach kind of goes in. So I'm going to get this a little bit more damp and then I've got my bleach here. It's in this tiny container. Remember to use gloves when you're handling this because you don't want that to get in your eyes or anything. And I've got a little bit of water to kind of dilute the bleach. Okay. Okay. Oof. Okay. So what we do is we just kind of put it into different pockets. I'm just gonna kind of um, sprinkle it. And it says that the longer that you let it sit and rest is how it starts to transform. So I don't know if it's gonna change it. Their videos online were like a reddish color. It looks like it's starting to move a little bit. Yep, I can see that the colors are starting to come up. The smellies. Maybe I'll get my mask. Alright, I'm pretty impressed with the results so far. The fact that it's changing a color to me is, like, impressive. So, I'm going to stick this in this container on the floor. Because this is how I transport things in my house with my disability. I just picked that up today. So it can be my bleach bucket. <laughs> now let's make this kind of fun and impactful. Looks like we're running out of bleach already. So I'm just going to dilute it so that I don't have to um, keep using chemicals because I'm not a big fan. It's changing color down there. It's looking pretty neat looking pretty neat um, so we've got this one very interesting Just sprinkle 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 I'm gonna throw it down in there this one very interesting sprinkle 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 and I'm doing the white first because I want to add this like blue tie-dye to the top because I'm the blue eye queen I don't know um, if it's going to do anything here but we're just going to for fun and then again this is my first time ever doing tie-dye so I might be just like full of shit you never know um I just had it, the um, container thingy, to pour. Hopefully you went to bed. just put a little bit in there I don't know I'm just gonna I feel like a scientist in his house I know it's probably like not safe to just be mixing chemicals uh, we'll see I'm like half joking as long as I don't spill it on anything it just seems like it's not one of those easy to come off things so I can see that the colors in the black is already coming up to red so let's do this blue. And I don't want to do a lot because I'm going to add a little more. Let's just see. I 
this thing, right? Cute. Love it. Yeah. All right, now let's try this one. I'll go a little slower. Squish it and squish it and squish it. So what we need to do now is now it's got like this orange redish color. I'm just gonna throw some blue on here and see what happens. It's just you know, it's just my style. It's just to try things out and see what really see what it does. So. So here's what we've got. Hey. We've got this looking thing. We've got all these little ones here. Right? So. Mm -hmm. Cool. I'm going to throw these in the washer for a quick rinse and then hang dry them. So. We'll return after we're done.